Do not try this at home. <laughs> okay. Going for a new amateur recreational saucer sled land speed record, Clark W. Griswold, Jr. Remember, don't try this at home, kids. I am a professional. Later, dudes. Let her rip, hang pen. Good morning. It is December 8th, and it is a gold day. I'm Andrew Barber. And I'm Nicholas Shrett. And we're your host of the WCHS Morning Announcements. The Calhoun debate team competed virtually at the Grady High School Carter King Tournament last weekend, December 4th and 5th. And the, the, Movis, the Novus Public Forum team of Mary Jane McKinnon and Will Thompson placed six overall out of a large group of novices. And McKinnon was awarded the fourth place speaker award, and Thompson took the sixth place speaker award. For the division, this is McKinnon and Thompson's third tournament as freshmen. Also winning key rounds were first-year debater Jasmine Rod Rodriguez and the policy team of Daisy Garcia and Nate Eichmann. Congratulations to all those people. Congrats. And remember to enter the Media Center's free coffee stinger raffle each week for a chance to win. And FCCLA, along with Ms. Davis's and Ms. Atkins' classes, are celebrating our ABM staff this week. If you get a chance, please tell ABM staff members thank you. They are having to work extra hard during this pandemic to make sure all of us stay safe. And today, members will be treated to more than appreciation, more than appreciative Monday. That was yesterday. That was yesterday. But today, they will get Taco House. Ta it's Taco Tuesday. Taco Tuesday. But uh, make sure that you tell them thank you because they do a lot for yeah. us that we don't really see. They sometimes. definitely deserve it. And Skills USA is collecting new unused blankets. These blankets will be given to various organizations around Gordon County to help with people in need. VAT, Gordon County Sheriff's Department, etc. Bring in, bring, by bringing in blankets, students have the chance to earn community service hours. For every two blankets a student brings in, they can earn an hour of, hour of community service. No more than 20 hours can be earned for this project. And in senior section announcements, there is nothing in the senior section still. I think it's been like that always. way for... Probably about the last 10 to 12 announcements. Yeah. I mean, absolutely nothing. Nothing. No. Maybe they'll get something here. But uh, today's weather, today's weather is a high of 45 and a low of 26. I woke up this morning, went outside, 30 degrees. <laughs> it was cold. It was cold. It was very cold. And in sports, any girl interested in playing girls soccer needs to see Coach Summerall before the end of the semester. Tryouts begin on January 11th. Any player interested in trying out should have a physical on file and must complete paperwork from Coach Summerall. Without each of these, you would not be allowed to try out. If you have any questions, please see Coach Summerall. And Calhoun Esports will be in action this week on both Tuesday and Thursday. Team Redemption will face Appalachia High School on Tuesday and Lambert High School on Thursday. The newbies will go up against Royalton Heartland High School on Tuesday and have already received a win on Thursday by forfeit. That's nice. This is the last nice. week of the regular season this fall, and playoffs will start on Saturday. Go Jackets! And today in history, on December 8th, as America's Pacific uh, Fleet lay in ruins at Pearl Harbor, President Franklin Roosevelt requests and receives a declaration of war against Japan. That's how it all started. Yep. Birthdays. Happy birthday, too. Let me see. Caitlin Blackman, Hunter Hammond, and Jaslyn Jimenez. Happy, Happy birthday, birthday to you all. We hope you all have a totally tubular Tuesday, and as always, go Jackets.